Well, this is my day 10 and I'm, I skipped yesterday, so I have to catch up. I'll have to do my catch up again on Sunday. Um, life got in the way. I uh, had a lot of things to do, which is no excuse. It's just telling me I've got to do this routine a lot earlier in the mornings so and do it as a primary thing before I do anything else. Um, I'm saying how to sort of perfect my schedule. At the same time, it was the end of the month, kind of ran out of food, so I didn't have enough energy got paid had to go and buy some food and you need nutrition to be able to do this exercise and one thing I'm um, I wanted to share too with is what's really helping my joints is this stuff um, MSM excellent for joints it's like a miracle you'll be able to do things and like I got this cheap at a drugstore. Well, it's not that cheap, probably 20 bucks. But I found that you can get it even cheaper in a pet store. Or it, we apparently treat pets better than we treat humans. And, but it's the exact same thing, and it's a lot cheaper. And this powder cost me roughly $40. And you use a very little bit. It'll probably last me a year for $40. And it's doing amazingly well. And I know I'm lacking something in my body that's creating these friggin' bags in my eyes and the wrinkles. So I did a little bit of research and, and thought I'm missing uh, some oils and vitamin A and D. So I'm now starting to take uh, cod oil. Cheap. These were roughly 10 bucks for 100 of them. Um, but I'm almost kind of seeing a, a big difference already. So I know one way or another, you, your eyes or any problem within your eyes, actually within any part of your body, if you're seeing something injured, um, it doesn't mean it can't be reversed. It's a matter of finding the path to be able to reverse it all. So, and, and my goal is to get rid of these bags and um, these wrinkles. I am not aging so it needs to be reversed and part of that is this routine and and what keeps you on a routine is definitely your psychology and changing your own psychology and I know for me I'm kind of getting caught up in I got to do this I got to do that I got to do this I got to do that and it's really really hard to just sit there and enjoy the moment and um, these workouts, I've got to shift my brain into thinking this is a workout, it's taking time out of my day, you know, into this is a time for me. This is a time where I get to just breathe and be in the moment and feel what it feels like to be what I want to be like. I'm not there yet, but while I'm doing these workouts, I'm visualizing in my mind I'm going to look good in that bathing suit. I'm going to look a lot younger. So I'm visualizing what it is that I want the most. <laughs> the most thing is I don't want to be freaking aging and I'm aging. So it's amazing that life is, is it takes us out of our way and prevents us from doing the very things that we want to do the most. And um I don't find it too much of a workout actually. If I can get myself in the moment and really enjoying it, I really do feel so much better. And everything I want is to feel better. So it's like, where's the psychology that's preventing me from doing what I want to do? I'm not pushing myself. I'm just doing as much as I possibly can. And I end up feeling a lot better. And I think it's showing too. I, I think I'm looking a lot better than I did just a week ago and I didn't really do all of that much so if it can make a huge difference for me I'm sure it'll make a huge difference for everybody else if you just do your own limits and put your mind a lot of it is in your mind if you visualize where it is you want to be your mind creates the body 
and like there's stuff in the middle ground but the mind creates the body by the mind making the body make the motion to create the body if that makes any sense at all so this is my day 10 a day late I will catch up on Sunday the goal is to do it a lot early in the morning so life won't get in the way peace out